rain. Yeah. You owe me, darling. Thank you. You're welcome. Scoops of that one okay. in the blue bowl. You can put it up. Go ahead, buddy. Good job. One. <laughs> two. Good job. Excellent work. That's it. Good job. The food out for them. Right, nice work. Hold on, that's backwards. Wait, 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 wait. That one's yours. And that one's yours. There we go. Good job. All right, Nick, we got to get their water. What's that? Flying! Where is a low flyer? There it is. Oh, it's a helicopter, Nikki. Go get the water for them, please. Woo! Woo! I love the enthusiasm. We need everybody who works in our lives to show this kind of enthusiasm. I love the energy. You're doing a great oh, job. Sprung. Yeah, it's great. Oh, they high five. I'm proud of you. Yes. You sitting on his lap, Kira? Nikki, is that puppy keeping you warm? Yeah. Have some weather. It's not. It's not intense, but all of a sudden we have no lights. You can see I'm in the dark. It's not. There's no weather. What's going on? Uh, there's there's weather. Out? There's weather out there. <laughs> Wouldn't be that much of a problem, but oh, that's Shannon's. I'm about to make some sauce. I was making pasta fagioli. So. Okay, all right. Let's just think positive. All right. The lights are back on. I can get back to making my sauce. And since I couldn't do anything, I went across the bridge and I got some pizza dough. And I know I didn't make it, but this was a knee-jerk reaction because we had a little downtime. But we're going to test out the, uh, the Detroit pan, Shan. I'm excited. I'm excited, too. I don't know how it's... regular mutts or fresh Regular mutts. Regular mutts. You know, it's all... I'm not really sure yet. I know it's regular mutts, but who knows how it's going to go. It's the first time. So, that's what's happening. And then we're heading off to basketball in a little while, right, Nick? Yep. I got called into work last minute, so I think I'm... Are you coming, Shannon? Yeah. All right, fantastic. That's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, and there's all kinds of delicious things happening, so that's what's happening. Jim, can you help me put some of the uh, waters w away? They got to go downstairs. Let's do it. Want to take those two on the floor? Those there. Yeah. I don't know. That one there, handsome. And both, great job. Kira, John, call the dogs. Oh, sorry, sorry. I got it. There we go. Lights on. Remember where they go on the top? Put them on the top shelf. Good. Up. Oh, yep. Up there. Nice job. Perfect. Good job. <laughs> Drinking that water. Cheeseburger. Oh, excuse you, Nicholas. Hey, excuse me, please. Excuse me. Excuse me. Good job. Yum. No bun. Nice move. Way to go, Nick. Great job. What we're doing with the Detroit style, we, we put the dough in the pan, we cover it with olive oil and then some plastic wrap, and you basically let it sit out all day. At the pizza store, Nikki, that's a lot. What's happening right now? Excuse me, say excuse me, please. Excuse me. Okay. At the pizza store, they let it sit out overnight. But I think that if we just, it's, what time is it now? Like 12-ish, Shannon? Yeah, almost 1. It's almost 1. If we let this sit out until dinner time, it should be pretty well risen. And then we'll bake it from there. All right, we're making Sunday sauce. And here's how we do it. We're going to start with some pork bones. We're going to brown these babies. That's the sound of deliciousness. And that's going to take about a minute or so to turn that down a little bit. This is the easiest thing in the world and the most delicious thing in the world. All you have to do is brown these four cones. Not even a minute, maybe 30 seconds on each side. 
Put the, put the camera in here, honey, so you see what it looks like. Nice. Pause it up. <laughs> okay, I'll pause it up. No, this is okay. I got you. Okay. And then for the amount of sauce that we're making, I'm going to put a whole onion in here. A large onion. A large, yeah, this is a big giant onion for sure. Otherwise, you use two small ones. And a head of garlic goes in as well. Whole head. A whole head of garlic. I'm going to get that good and brown. It took me a little while to know what a head of garlic is as opposed to a clove of garlic. Clove. Definitely an entire head. <laughs> and so we're just going to let that cook until it gets brown. And then we're going to add our sauce. Okay. Delicious. Your cans of tomatoes. And what kind are you using? What am I using today? Okay, we're using um, a couple of different kinds. We have Tudor Russo crushed tomatoes. We're going to use four cans of those. And then we're using, did we use three cans of the San Marzano? I don't yeah. typically use the San Marzano tomatoes when I, when I uh, cook with the meat. Okay. Because that's a little bit sweeter. Uh, but that's what we had before the delivery came. So it's still going to be delicious. Notice all the cabinets open behind Are they? <laughs> Much better. It's hard to see, but we are just about ready. The garlic and onions are good and brown. I'm going to just pull this off the burner. Let's put it up there for a minute and add the sauce. It's two. It's three. Four and five. Six. We actually use six, not seven. One of those cans is in Shannon's pasta fagiola. I'm going to put a little salt, pepper, and oregano in. And here's the problem, I don't really measure. I just kind of do it by eye, and that's about right. i do the same thing with the salt. No measuring. No, I don't measure when I do this. This is just, I get whispers from my Italian ancestors, and they say that's just enough. And that's how I do it. And it seems to work out pretty well. Yep, that's perfect. Now I'm gonna add a handful of basil. This was frozen. Actually, we go a little bit more than that. This is actually from our garden from the summer that we, we froze. And there you go. Give it a mix. Bye, school. Peace no out. No school. You're not going to school today. You're off. It's Sunday. Sunday, Monday, All my right. love. Deliciousness is underway. And when I'm in the mood, I add a little crushed red pepper as well, which I'm going to do today. And that much. Flip the cushions for the DOGs. Do that. Uh, get your water bottle. I can move. Yeah, I can move. Listen, oh, why don't we leave Spider Man here, okay? Good job. Be right there waiting for you. Thumbs you up. He's got it. It's right there. Just gotta fill it up, I guess. Yeah, fill it up, Nikki. You wanna fill it up for us, buddy? Can you fill it up? We're gonna we're gonna listen when they tell us to with the other kids, okay? Nikki, your money. Sharpshooter. Nick, you were money. It's like easy. You couldn't miss. Yeah. Kid was amazing. On top, that is a great <laughs> job, Shannon. Come over here closer with that because this is some t shirt order this from our good box. friend Maria Hammerman, Hammerman in New Hyde Park. I want to we see. We love you. I want, I want video. I want a picture of all these people who are going to wear these shirts. Yeah, that's Hammerman. a party. This little rat is guilty. He's guilty. Years of academy training wasted. This is Sam's routine that we shouldn't mess with. Right? Like, because Sam gets it right. Sam does everything Sam does right. Everything right. Yes, he does. Four o'clock or so, Sam shows up. They sit on the couch for about 10 minutes. Then they head to the mailbox, which we're doing right now. Then they throw rocks. 
we're gonna do. And then he goes, then he goes in the hot tub, the so-called hot tub. And then he makes a cheeseburger. So that's what we're gonna try to do. Cause it, cause it works. He'll go in for a short period of time. You can't mess with the system that works, honey, in my opinion. Right, Nick? Right. He opens that one-handed without even looking. Another box. That's a lot of stuff today. Get out! Get out! Use two hands, Nick. Oh, you want me to help you? Uh, man! Wow, That's they really stuffed that in there. I'll get it, I'll get it. He's alive! You did it. Good job, buddy. Alright, the sauce smells unbelievable. We, we've all already tasted it. Nikki's had some as well. But here's how you know if it's done. What we're going to do is take a piece of meat out. We're going to put it in this bowl. And the meat should just fall right off. Yeah, this piece of meat just falling right off. Oh, goodness gracious. Can you see that, Shannon? That would mean it's ready. Oh, yes. It's just falling off. That's it's, for me. Yeah, That's the, for the me. taste is going to be unbelievable. All right. How you doing in there, handsome? Okay? Hey! You're doing a great job. <laughs> we're gonna do. We we took the meat off of the pork bones that we made the sauce with because we're gonna use that to put on top of our Detroit pizza, which has risen beautifully. We have all the sauce all separated and ready to get stored. Um, and we have we have some meal prep happening. Shannon made some pasta fagioli, which is delicious. We've eaten that a little bit. And to wrap it up, we have some chicken cutlets for the week. Well, a couple days. That's what we got. Ta-da! Nick, I'm very proud of you. You're going to, there's no way you're not going to sleep tonight after this. But it's, it's time to jump in the shower, Shannon. Got it. You got a towel here? Here you go. We're, it's time to get out, buddy. I know you want to stay. You did a great job. We're going to go in again tomorrow. Come on out, handsome. You're the best person. Come on. Good job. All right, it's loaded up with cheese, and I've never done this before, so I'm not quite sure how much cheese to put. I feel like uh, that's a good amount. The whole thing with the Detroit is that the cheese has got to get baked along the sides of the pan, and it's supposed to get caramelized, and it should be delicious. And it goes on the bottom. So we're very excited about this. I think it's going to be fantastic. Put a little oregano over the top. And some Pecorino Romano. That is going to be delicious. I'm just going to put the pork on half because I don't know if Nick is going to like it. That is going to be delish. Nikki never had thick pizza before, so we're not sure. It's fun, You're going to like it, Nick. I'm going to add a little uh, crushed red pepper to mine, honey. Go for it. I mean, that looks fantastic. The crust came out beautifully. It's time for the moment of truth. I mean, I can tell you that it has the right feeling, for sure. I mean, it's, it's very, very light. Oh, the crunch is there. Yeah. Nikki, is it good? What do you think? Good, right? Do I nail it? I hear it from here. Oh my god. It's good? Oh, yeah. Man. Yeah, it's oh, delicious. Oh gosh, yeah. We had some great day, didn't we? Did you have fun playing basketball? Yeah. Come back over here. Did you like it? Did you like the pizza we had? Yes. And did you like your hamburger as well that yeah. I made you after the pizza? Because I don't think you were crazy about it. We had a great weekend, buddy. I'm really proud of you. Can you say goodbye to everybody? Let's see you, Ty. Very good, handsome.